hi guys welcome back to another video of easy tutorials today in this video we are going to create an animated logo for netflix using html and css on my computer screen you can see we have the netflix logo with animation and at the bottom of this logo you can see this curve pattern we will create this logo using html and css so before starting this video please hit the like button and subscribe my channel easy tutorials now let's start the video here in this folder you can see I have one HTML file, one CSS file. Let me open these files with my code editor. I am using Visual Studio Code. You can use any code editor. So this is the HTML file where I have added the basic HTML structure. And this one is the CSS file. In this HTML file I have added this link tag that will connect the HTML and CSS file. Next we will add the code in the body tag that will be displayed on our web page. So here we will create one div with the class name Netflix and inside this div we will create a span tag with the class name left. Let's duplicate it and here we will change the class name center and this one right. So we have one div with the class name Netflix then three spans with the class name left, center and right. Now we will come back to the CSS file. First here we will add CSS for the body. In this body we will add the color. It will be black. So we will add the background triple zero that is black color. After that let's come back and here we have the class name Netflix. So just copy this one and add it here. Now for this Netflix div we will add width. It will be 150 pixel and height 250 pixel. Position will be absolute, then top 50%, left 50%, and transform translate minus 50% and minus 50%, so that it will be in the center of the web page. And here we will add the background color. So write background and let's add the color triple F, which is white color. So we have added the width and height and it will position it in the center and this is the background color. After that come back to the folder and open this HTML file with any web browser. So you can see this white box in the center of this web page. Let me close this browser and I will open this web page with the Visual Studio Code extension called Live Server so that it will refresh the web page automatically whenever we will add any changes in the code file. So you can see the same web page again but the URL has been changed. Now. Just come back and uh, in this Netflix we have the span 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 so here come back and write the same class name then write span. In this one we will add the width, width will be 50 pixel and height will be 100%. Then we will add the background and color code position will be absolute. So you can see all three spans are over each other. So let's come back and we will add different position for each span. So in this one you can see we have the class name left, center and right. So just copy the first class name left. Now for the left one we will add left 0 and bottom 0. So it will be in the left side and starting from the bottom. Now let's add the second class name center. Write it here. For this one, we will add top 0 and left 0. Next, we will add transform skew x, it will be 22 degree. And uh, transform origin will be top and left. After that we will add the CSS for this one which is right. Add this class name here and uh, it will be in the right side so write 0 and bottom 0. Next we will come back to the web page. You can see it looks like an n letter. 
next we have to remove the color which is white color in the background so just come back and i will remove this white color here it is in netflix just delete this one so it looks good this n later next we have to add some shadow in the middle span so just come back and in the center we will add box shadow box shadow it will be 0 0 50 pixel and color set index 2 now it is good after that we have to make this bottom like a curve style so just come back and here we will add the class name dot netflix and after in this one we will add the content content will be empty then width it will be 120 percent and uh, height will be 20 pixel and border radius border radius will be 50 percent and the background color so let's add the background white for now and here we will add the position position will be absolute it will be left minus 10 percent and bottom minus 10 pixel and increase the z index z index will be 5 after adding this come back you can see this white color at the bottom and if we will make it black you can see if i change this color triple zero black so you can see the bottom looks like a curve next we have to add the animation in this later so just come back we have to animate all the span which is left center and right so first here we will add animation anim one second linear and forwards this same animation will be displayed in each span so paste it here in the center and in the right also next we have to add the keyframes for this anim so here we will add keyframes anim and uh, at 100 percent we will add height 100 percent and initially we will change the height you can see for all the span we have added the height 100 percent so we will make it zero so initially the height will be zero and after the animation it will become 100 percent so after adding this come back to the web page you can see all the span is increasing but right now this animation is happening at the same time so we have to add the delay in each span for that just come back and here in this left we will add animation delay of one second copy this one and in this center we will add the animation delay of two second and in this last one we will add animation delay of three seconds after that again come back to the web page you can see if i refresh the web page this animation looks perfect so finally we have completed this animated netflix logo design using html and css i hope this video will be helpful for you if you have any question you can ask me in the comment section please like and share this video and also subscribe my channel easy tutorials to watch more videos like this one Thank you so much for watching this video.